Hi, I'm Bruce Devlin, and today's Bruce's Shorts, BPM and IMF, just good friends or necessary bedfellows. So what are they? Well, BPM is business process management, and IMF is the interoperable mastering format. Now, if you've looked into the details of IMF, and if you haven't, go and have a look at my webinar, you realize it's quite a complicated format. And that's because it's solving quite a difficult business process. That business process is creating multiple versions to deliver content to multiple territories, whether they're domestic territories or international territories. That whole management of media is quite complicated. And it can be automated, because at the end of the day, once you've generated a version for a particular territory, you can generate deltas on that version to maybe localize it for a particular advertising region, or maybe add extra captions or subtitles or extra audio tracks to generate a bit more revenue for that media. And because you can automate it, it would be really nice to be able to track the different processes that you have applied to that version. And that's where BPM comes in. BPM is a methodology that allows you to put all of your tasks and processes together, automate them, control them, and manage them, and most importantly, get some statistics back on whether or not those processes, coupled with those versions, are good for your business. There are many BPM tools out there. Some of them are custom written, some of them are based on standards. But all of them have one thing in common, and that's the ability for you to manage the business and automate the tasks that generate revenue from the content that you have. If your BPM suppliers don't speak in those languages but speak purely in technology, then really what you're buying is a workflow orchestrator and not a business process manager. As we move into the future and as IMF rolls out over 2016 and 2017, I think you'll find that automating version creation, distribution and production is going to be really important and those that master it will have a better bottom line than those that don't. Good luck with that and if you need any tips, drop me an email. See you at the next one.